Topic: Childhood Memory. IELTS Speaking Part Two. Describe a happy childhood memory. You should say when and where the incident you remember happened, who you were with, what happened exactly, explain why it is a happy memory, how it affected you in your life, explain why you still remember it. A happy childhood memory that I have is when my brothers and I decided to make a snowman one day when we were bored to tears. It was winter vacation. We were off from school, and we already had done every activity under the sun indoors. We felt stuffy inside, and the glistening white snow that was piling up outside seemed so inviting. We were dying to go outside and have some fun. We had to wear warm layers of clothing, hats and gloves, heavy jackets, so we did not get sick. Then we went outside and started to make snowballs. Some of the other neighborhood children also saw us and decided to come out and play. Soon there was a whole group of children all outside who were as busy as bees making snow angels, snowmen, forts, or having snowball fights. All the children got excited and decided to have a snowball fight match, where we broke into two teams on opposite ends. We all had to work together and build a fort to hide from the enemy team. On the side, we had to throw snowballs on the other team's fort until it collapsed or they surrendered. This game was loads of fun, even though it was a little hazardous, as kids could really hurt each other with snowballs. We were all so immersed in having fun that time seemed to fly by, and it was dark. However, it was heartwarming to see one of my neighbors invited all children to cups of warm hot chocolate. This memory reminds me of compassion between people in a neighborhood, and how each other's company made us very happy. It also showed me how the happiest things in life are simple. We did not need to spend much money to have a good time. I remember it because it was one of the happiest times in my life, as we all took care of each other as neighbors living in a community. This event also showed us how, if you want change, you have to do something. My brothers and I were bored, and there was lots of snow, so we decided to make the best of the situation by playing outside and entertaining ourselves. I hope in the future I can also pass down these virtues that having a good time requires the company of good people, not tons of money.